I'm really excited about this review we're going to do because it's a little bit different, but I think it's something that I really think you will find handy, helpful. But look, I got a little first aid kit. I say little, but this bad boy right here has 152 pieces in it. It is made by Swiss Safe. I'm not affiliated, but it's just something that I picked up along the way. I actually got it from Amazon. I don't know where else you can get it. Um, but I picked it up because for like 20 bucks, I thought it would be something that would be really handy and something that everyone should have. Uh, I haven't even opened it up yet to see everything that is in it other than knowing it has the 152 pieces in it uh, that I can read on the back here. It tells, kind of lists everything. But that's the fun. You want to open it up and, you know, put that hands on or look see or whatever. But I was like, you know what? I gotta share it with my peeps because they may want one also. And if I like it enough and think it's worth the money, I probably will get another one just so we have an, another one for both our vehicles. Uh, I might even get another one for the house because 20 bucks to feel like you have something that will help you. First aid, I mean, come on. More than likely, everybody's got some Band-Aids and some ointment and, and all that good, good stuff laying around. But it is awfully nice to know when someone gets hurt, you can run and grab one thing and it's all, you know, in one spot, especially if you're on the go. If you're, you know, you've got kids or even, it doesn't matter, just yourself, you cut yourself. You know, band-aids are always something that you think, ah, I, it's all right, I don't need to get any. But then when you need one and you don't have one, it's kind of a big deal at least for me. So I just thought I would share with you what all's in here. So let's open this bad boy up. The zipper goes all the way around so it opens up nice. Ooh, check it out. She's got little mesh pockets for different things. So let's just get going right off the bat. Hmm, this looks like just a little uh, coin purse of some type. Probably has stuff in it. Let's find out. It said something about some bonuses, so this might be my my bonus. Ooh, what do we have? Some tape. Oh, it looks like there's some kind of little baggy, or uh, probably like a poncho. Some Q-tips. So this is like a little mini uh, first aid. You know, something that you could probably like put in your purse. I think that's the bonus. It's got some cotton swabs. Uh, some little alcohol pads. So in other words, I think this is just uh, a few things that you can, like I said, put in your purse, be handy. Uh, there's some band-aids of different sizes in this. So it is, it's just like a little coin purse. And this I think is like um, medical tape. Something, like I said, it's like a little bonus that you can put like in your purse. Or if you want to, I guess you could split this off until you get a second one for one of your vehicles. You've got, you know, something a little handy. Or throw in a diaper bag or uh, any kind of bag for the kids. I don't know. Use what you want to. But that's nice. And I like that it's red and it's kind of like, hey, first aid right here. <laughs> okay, let's start off with one of the pouch sides. First aid guide. So, oh look, it's got different types of things for like if you ingest poison or bites or animal bites. Um, so that's a nice little handy book if you can compose yourself in during a crisis or during someone needing first aid, you'd be able to look it up. So it uh, doesn't have a lot, but it's a little first aid guide. That's pretty cool. And then here, these are filled with uh, band-aids, like little you know, just regular size band-aids, nothing special. I kind of like it that they're in a, an extra packet so that you could like take those out if you want. But yeah, just like little strips of band-aids. These are just their brand, I guess. So that's okay. Okay, now that's, that's one little side of the pouch that came out of. So let's put that back. Let's be neat about it, okay? Okay, what we got over here? Okay, these look like little cotton swabs. Oh, look, y'all, this is cool. It has little cotton, uh, not cotton swabs, I'm sorry, but alcohol swabs, you know, little pads. It's got a compass. That's cool. 
and some more tape. Uh, a whistle. I got a whistle. That's cool. Try if you're you get lost or something, or you get attacked or whatever. Look at I attacked and I smile. I don't mean it that way. <laughs> I'm just excited. You know, it's kind of like check it out. <laughs> got some safety pins it's got a compass now I know a lot of people say I got that on my phone if you're out stranded somewhere you know your phone might not work everywhere so something you might want to try to figure out where you're at you know I know some people are like well I don't know where this one's north south east or west but I still think it comes handy I think that's cool there's little buttons in here so this is kind of like a little mini sewing kit it does have some thread in there also say surf a uh, first aid kit that even has a little sewing kit in and i was going to tell you all i picked up a little sewing kit and this is on the side this is this little <laughs> mom don't that if you're watching doesn't that kind of look like the little purse that i had this little see-through purse anyhow i don't know <laughs> but it has it's a little sewing kit i picked it up for like a dollar dollar fifty i think it was a dollar Hey, I'm going to tell you something. When you need a needle and thread or some pins or a little um, scissors or something, that stuff comes in handy. So I picked up one of those. I, I, you're all probably thinking, what, are you prepping or something? Well, I'm just trying to be prepared. I've always, seems like in my life, when I wasn't prepared, it happened. But when I was prepared, it didn't. So that's all i got to say about that. Uh, a glow stick. What do you think about that? Those things come real hand. They really put off a lot of light. So yeah, if you can get a hold of any of these, they're really handy to have. Um, oh, little set of tweezers. Looks like it's very coming out. Emergency blanket, very handy to have. Um, if you were to get caught, if it's cold or whatever. And plus they're kind of shiny too, so they can reflect. reflect. <laughs> And people can see you and everything. This also has some scissors. And I showed you the tweezers. Uh, looks like some, they're called examination gloves. They're uh, rubber gloves. Uh, this pouch, this pouch has some more Q-tips, some cotton pads, some uh, uh, gauze, stuff like that. Of course, that'd be handy. Uh, what we have here, what we have here, triangular bandage. So it's a bigger bandage that you can make, um, you know, like, like not a tourniquet, but maybe something to wrap around like a person's head or an eye or their waist or something like that. So something a little bit bigger. And then here's some other more um, gauze bandage. Okay. And what do we have here? Oh, here's an ice pack. That comes in handy. You should always have ice packs. Something I never really thought about much of when I made my own first aid kits that's something else y'all you can buy a lot of this stuff and make it yourself 20 bucks though yeah if 20 dollars i could probably replace everything in here but it's so handy and it's there and it's there for you um this is some more uh, abdominal pads so that's something a little bit thicker i'm different this is abdominal pads I don't want to open it up, but it it looks something more uh, that would be more absorbent than like a regular gauze or something like that. So there's that. And you all, know, that is about it. So you do get a lot of your typical first aid things. I don't know what this plastic thing here is. I don't know if it's like a... Uh, I don't know what it is. <laughs> I don't know what that one is. Oh, I guess I could. I can take it out of this bag without ruining it. And then it's in another little bag. I don't know what this is. You know what? It's almost like it's a little makeshift. I don't want to say tent. But or like a little cover. I'm getting nosy, y'all. I'm going to have to get that out of there and find out. Single use only. It's a. Oh, I'm still looking, y'all. Top. 
Oh, it's a mouth to mouth. Oh, it's for CPR. So that you can, you know, put it over top of someone's mouth and have plenty of coverage and still be able to help them. That's what's in that other little one. So yeah, that's, that's cool. That way you feel like, you know, if you can keep your composure to get something like this to help someone. I guess that's another reason why you should have stuff like that handy if you really want to help someone and be protective for yourself, especially the kind of days we live in. So yeah, that's really all that's in here, but for 20 bucks, that's not bad. I'm just still impressed with the compass. <laughs> so yeah, I'm just telling you, you know, to be a good Girl Scout or Boy Scout and be prepared and get you some, I mean, if, like I said, if you don't have $20, do you have five? Go get you some Band-Aids. Uh, something that I'll, uh, some Band-Aids, some ointment. Uh, this is more of a survival-like kit. Uh, I will probably add a couple of things like ointment. Um, just because I think that would come in handy. But yeah, this is a nice little kit for 20 bucks. Not bad. Uh, are there better ones? Heck, if I know. I just wanted to share with you all what I got. That's all. So I'm putting everything back in here all nice and nice. All neat and everything so that I don't lose anything. But if you have a, a few extra dollars, grab something like this. If you have a little bit of extra space, might I suggest you buy a few extra things just because things are just getting a little bit more expensive and I'm not putting any fear you know that fear mongering and stuff you don't need to do that just put your faith in God but if you've got a little bit of space grab yourself a little bit of extra even toilet paper paper towels you don't have to go crazy but wouldn't it be nice to know that if you got your last roll that there's still one roll over there do you see what I'm saying just stuff like that it's just my way of saying hey I care about you and I want to tell you get you some lights Remember, I have done other, in my other videos, I think I even have a light here that runs on water. <laughs> and speaking of water, please make sure you hit that subscribe button because uh, one of my next videos is going to be on our new Berkey system, which is a water uh, system that we got. I'm so excited about it. It's a little bit of an investment. So I want you to, you know, I want to share in what we got so that you'll see that, hey, do I want one of them or not? Or, you know, just to check it out. Uh, not affiliated or anything like that. It's just me wanting to share my information and findings with you. So I hope this has been uh, informative for you and that you've enjoyed it. Again, hit that subscribe button, ding that bell. That way you get all kinds of notifications for when we do um, our videos and put them out for you. And hey, if you'll give me a thumbs up, that helps the algorithm and it helps me out. And me helping you, we're all helping each other. Ain't that pretty? <laughs> Thanks again for tuning in. You take care of yourself. Please love yourself. Love someone else. Life is way too short. And I'll see you next time right here. Same channel. Same bat channel. I don't know what I'm trying to say. You take care of yourself. All right. God bless. Bye. <laughs>